afternoon, everybody. I'm back um, working on a set of tiles for a young man who wants to get these for his um, someone special in his life. Um, his name is Aiden. He, I met him at a bazaar yesterday. He was a very, very sweet young boy. Lot of, had a lot of hardship in his life recently. Um, and he ordered a set of custom tiles for me that he paid for from his own money. And he was a very sweet, sweet young man. So I am, he, he picked out the color scheme and everything he wanted. So I've got a set of tiles ready um, with backs on them. But um, I'm going to experiment on a couple of tiles to see, um, to get the style he wants. He wants them with a white base. A white swipey style but not as a swipe so he wants him kind of like a geode um, with like the the swipe type um, the colors he picked was metallics orange green and blue and I've used artist loft um, colors to which I have mixed with um, a flow trawl to keep them separated and Liquitex um, pouring medium um, to give them some base, of course, and to give them the geode um, coloring style, uh, the mix type of thing. I've mixed every one of them with um, a silicone oil. Um, and they're all in their own little cups. So, and I've got a white house paint mixed with flow troll and water to give it a, a good liquid base. I've got my tiles already prepped that I want to do for his his main ones. So that way when I resin them for him, um, they're already taped off on the back. Unless these turn out really good and then I will end up taping these off before I resin them. So. I'm going to start off by putting, if I can get my, there we go, my base down. And I've got them all mixed. I'm just going to start with putting the blue. Metallic, like I said, these all got about two or three drops probably closer to two drops of the silicone in it. These are the colors he picked. You can already see him starting to form the cells on there. I'm going to give it a quick blowout and then I'm going to spin it out for it. I'll probably do a couple styles to see which one I like the best. Oh, you can already see the cells forming. Oh, that's going to be so cute. Look at all the cells already forming on that. Oh. Now I'm going to kind of spin this out a little bit and have it go. Let's see which one I like the best. Because he said he wanted a white base. These colors... really cute.
get a little paint there on the corners, give it one more nice little spin. That way it spreads a little bit more. That looks really cool. Oops, I bet you I just got white paint all through my hair. Wouldn't be the first time, though. All right. Yes, this is a cake spatula. Okay. Let's touch all the corners. Make sure everywhere has paint on it. Okay. There's that one, which is kind of cute. I like it. Not quite, I don't think, what he was requesting. Let's do that. Put that one there, because he wanted more of a, like a geode. So I might have to do more of a flip cup. Let's put a little bit of Okay, let's set that down. Put a little bit more of this in there. And let's do a little bit more of each of these. Because I think that's the type that I had on my table that he really liked. Was this style. We shall see though. Okay. Do a smidge more white because he wanted it white with white, so okay. Now for a flip cup, you do this, you literally flip cup. Now I'll set that back down. And then you just move that. Yeah, I think that might be the style he wanted. Because it kind of gives you that geode pattern. Now, let me pull this up so you guys can see. We have... And you kind of just tip. Kind of like you do a painting. And you just cover the whole tile. Although I think I'll do a little bit more blue and orange. Yeah. I think that's what he wanted was that this. Okay. All right, guys. I think this is what I'm going to do. It's going to kind of look like this. Can you see all the cells over here? Let's see, there you go. See all the cells there? Okay. 
It says it kind of looks like a geode. Now I got a big old heap of mess down here. And let me grab, see if I can reach behind me for my uh, snot monsters. Where are my cups? Oh, they're behind me on the other side. I think this is what he's looking for because it's more of a okay all right so let me grab mine and do a little less white a little more colors let me have this miss mosh one here might as well pour it. I always go ahead and pour my mess ups because you never know who might like it. I'll back it, resin it, or put the resin on it and let me put it down here because then Somebody might like it and want a single coaster. It might be a single person that just needs one coaster for their office or whatnot. Because actually this one is really quite beautiful. And sometimes I just have enough paint left to do one coaster. And there, I see no reason to waste any paint. Because that one actually turned out quite beautiful. I don't know if you guys can see it. How pretty that is. It's very, very gorgeous. Okay. I'll set that one right there. Let me rinse dry off my hands because I'm blue. I'm blue. I'm a bit, I'm a bit. Sorry. Now, let me... Move some of the stuff here, guys. <laughs> Black paint. I think I need more paint, people. What do you think? Of course, right? How could you not need more paint? I mean, it's just like a necessity for a painter to have need more paint like it is to breathe. I love my paints. Me get my air bubbles off of these yes okay so let me do four of those okay now that we know what we is doing we will put a white base in. We'll grab this, which is taped off. We'll put that down. I think you guys can see. Oh, you cannot. Okay, let me push this back here a little bit. There you go. Put blue. Two good drops of blue. Good drops of green. Good drops of orange. A smaller drop of, let me see if I got you my camera. White. Not a lot though, because you don't need a lot to cover this little thing. Another good drop of blue. Good drop of green. Another good drop of orange. Okay. Let's see how this goes, guys. All right, you ready? Flip her up. Okay. Let's 
set this one up here so I can do my overflow on it. I kind of want to get more of the white off of there and stick with more of the color. You know what? I'm going to put a droppy of green right there. not coming out the way I want them. Hmm. There we go. There we are. You see him now? I think I just tripled my hair in it. That's better. I like that one better. Okay. So, after blowing on it, this is what I got. Still not sure if I like it, though. liked it better than the other one, although I like that one. Oh, looks like my hair just came down. But there is what I got after blowing on it. Hmm. Okay. I think I'm going to take a quick little break and Google and make sure I'm doing it. Well, I mean, I know I'm doing it, but I want to get the right thing for this young man. I'll be back. All right. I'm back. I've decided a different path for this. Instead of using my house paint, I'm using just white paint. Putting a little bit in the bottom. <clears throat> um, putting my blue in. My green in. You don't need a lot. My orange in. And then some metallic white. This is all stuff I've had pre-made. Some of it is, I should say, the white and the my two whites are. My tile that I got made up. I just did one and it turned out super cute. Okay, flip cup. You can see the cells already in the bottom of the cup which I love. You can already see the cells starting on here. So let's roll this around the tile. See those cells popping out on there for him. I think he'll be happy with this color scheme like this with all the cells and stuff.
here. I think you guys can see all that. I think that looks really pretty. Okay. Get it going that way. Make sure all the corners get cut, touched. Wow, that, that is so cool. I think you guys can see that. Yep. <clears throat> Grab my torch. Good once over, which will allow more cells to come out. More cells will continue to come out the longer it sits. And I think little Aiden will just be tickled pink with this. Okay. Same cup. White in the bottom. Blue. Orange. The green. <clears throat> Excuse me. I apologize. And then metallic white. And then flip her over. Let it kind of pop down. Oh yeah, those cells are popping out good on that. Roll that around. Yeah, that looks really good. Yeah. Okay. Roll it over this way. So that way it gets over there. I love painting, but I will say it is not a very clean thing. I get it everywhere. Get a little paint on that corner, that way it flows faster. Okay, there's that one. That is the one neat thing with paint is not one is ever the same. Torch it, get the air bubbles off, and set it over here so it can dry. And I need to get one more cup. So they have some worth of six. Okay, white on the bottom. <clears throat> and 
a boo. Orange. Gorgeous green. And the metallic white. And this cup, I will just tip it onto here so that way I don't lose any of the paint. That way it drips down onto that tile. that over to there. This has got some beautiful cells in there. Put that over on that one. I'm hoping little Aiden loves these for his gift. that way I will give you guys a close-up as soon as I get the four of these done sorry they take so long sometimes okay All right. So cool. I'm going to go this way a smidge. That way it kind of pulls it back down. Kind of covering this area right here a little bit. It's good though. I'll leave it like that. I grab my napkin and I will torch that real quick. Get the air bubbles out of it. Okay, let me pull y'all off and then I will give you a close up of these four. I'll be right back. <laughs> 